buddy it's a little bit early six o'clock six thirty somewhere around there we are actually heading over to drop our vehicle off at Foffs here in town their local tire shop and we're gonna get the four-wheel alignment done and our tires come in today which is crazy because I canceled the order for the open country tires because they were taking forever to get here so then I went and decided to do the KO2 tires that everybody keeps recommending for the Bronco Sports. They're coming in today. Well, we just ordered those yesterday. So they'll be in today. We're going to get those installed too. So stay tuned. Can't really see. It's a, we'll try to get some more footage and stuff later on when we go to drop the tires and stuff off because those come in a little bit later. But we're gonna get this dropped off so we can at least get the wheel alignment done. Um, so yeah, say goodbye to the stock. In my eyes, POS Michelin tires. Usually I like Michelin tires. Usually they make a good tire, but these tires here just suck. Like. You know, when, we were, when you're were on the ice and stuff like that, not even giving a gas, just rolling across there, you'll still slide around in this thing, which is crazy because I've never, I've never seen a vehicle do that. Like, I, I, I guess it can be the, I, I, I guess, yeah, it, I have seen it done when you're like giving a gas, but usually when you're just rolling across there, I don't. Uh, these, these tires aren't gripping for nothing. Even even though they are all season tires, I think they're garbage. Like so. We're going to try out the all-terrain tires and see how how much better it works, and yeah, be ready. She's going to have a whole new look to her later on today. Okay, so we are here, and check it out. Carson's car is here. I guess he's getting some work done on it. He's got a different hood, too. Remember when he got this thing, he had, a, had one of those carbon fiber hoods on there, and yeah, that, cool. So, Bob's Tire and Auto. Yep, we're out here. This is right out here by the Wendy's, and... Definitely a nice place to go if you guys are looking for some good tire work done. But because we have specific tires we wanted for that there, um, we ordered our own. So we're going to get this all dropped off and then stop back later once the tires get in. Okay, everybody. I forgot my GoPro, but we're going to still do this. We got the tires in. We're going to turn these over to Fops here. And we're going to let them get these installed. There she is. Dude, those things are freaking like way more aggressive those things are sick so welcome back we have done a lot of research on this and we've uh, just wanted to give you guys an update on the lift kit and the tires that we just got it added on as you guys saw earlier we did get the um, bf goodridge ko2 tires put on um, a lot more aggressive a lot more beef on them so that's going to definitely help us out on the trails um, but we ran into a problem so we took it out to fobs to go get the the um, alignment done they can't do it because they're saying the back is not adjustable um, I talked to Ben over at HRG engineering um, he says that the back is adjustable um, so we actually have an appointment for I think it's February 1st um, to go down and get this done actually at a Ford dealership I talked to uh, the one uh, not in town they won't even touch it because we did the lift kit so um, we are going to be going to the one about 20 miles away, go over there, have them adjusted. They're pretty confident they can get this all done. Uh, according to Ben at HRG, um, he's had a couple of these done as well too from the Ford dealership. So because they have the specs and everything to do that, I think that's one of the recommendations I'm going to recommend for you guys to do is actually go and take it to a Ford dealership and have them do the alignment um, once you get this done. Um, you can still feel some of the stuff on the back where it's not quite aligned and if you don't get it aligned um, with this lift it will chew up your back tires um, i actually found out factory mine was not even aligned properly because the inside of the tires were wearing out and getting choppy 
Um, so we haven't really done anything until we put this lift kit on and then all of a sudden we saw that. And I literally only had maybe 10, 15 miles on the, on the lift kit before I put these tires. We went with the 255, 55 R18s with the factory rim. Um, it's a little bit beefier, a little bit wider than the rim, but that's okay. Uh, we wanted something that's going to be definitely something that can give us some grip when we're on the trails. Um, KO2, we went with this one here just because we were waiting for the open country um, uh, AT2 tires to come available, but they were not um, available, and we got tired of waiting. So, honestly, KO2s actually look really good on this thing. Um, it gives a, a lot more aggressive, mean look. We do have the wheel spacers. We are going to be doing a video on installing. Um, so if you guys are interested in this, make sure you guys hit up HRG Engineering. Um, link's going to be right down below. Um, they have the lift kit for the Baby Bronco 2021 Bronco Sport. So there she is. We got lots of content coming out. We got lots of videos. We are right behind. We are falling behind right now. Um, what's really great about this is um, it's not here right now, but you guys are in for a treat next week. We are bringing and we're going to reveal out what we purchased for the trails. So I don't want to ruin the surprise. Make sure you guys check back next week. Um, if you guys like this video, make sure you guys smash that like button. Um, helps us out. Also, if you guys have any comments or questions, we're going to be starting this uh, Saturday morning thing. It's not going to be for about a week or two, um, but we are going to be doing a Saturday morning uh, question and answer thing that we're going to do and try to get everybody's comments and everything answered as far as what they have for questions. So um, if you guys are new to the channel, please subscribe. If you guys are returning, appreciate it. Make sure you guys show us some love. See you next time and keep trailing.